Well, thanks to advances in technology, farms today just take fewer people to run them, which in turn means more and more of us don't quite understand the work it takes to put food on our plates, which is why one Northwest Oklahoma teacher brings her farm to the classroom. Well, it's early evening on the Gonzalez farm just outside of Longdale and time for chores. I may spend uh, 30 minutes, maybe an hour, it just depends on the day. Well, Linda Gonzalez and her husband spend most evenings taking care of beef cattle and checking on their irrigated Bermuda grass. I use pictures of, we call him KDT, and I use pictures of him to show the classroom. A job she loves almost as much as her other one. We have a bunch of baby calves out in the pasture and I wanted to bring some pictures. Gonzalez teaches wild. fourth grade at Cornelison Elementary in Fairview, integrating her life on the farm with her time in the classroom. I want the students to understand the work that goes into it, how much the farmers do to provide food for all of them. I want them to know where the food comes from. And it's that passion that helped earn her this year's Ag in the Classroom Teacher of the Year honors. Please join me as we honor, celebrate, and recognize our Oklahoma 2010 Ag in the Classroom Teacher of the Year from Fairview, Ms. Linda Gonzalez. Presented the award as part of Ag Day festivities at the Capitol, Gonzalez knows the importance of what she does. Last year, I also had a student that thought it was really neat. I was teaching a lesson, and she said, gee, it's nice to have a teacher who's also a farmer. And I, that made me feel good. And these are lessons as applicable here in the middle of farm country as anywhere in the nation, even though there's a farm implement dealer just over my shoulder. And I'm standing here in the middle of the wheat field right across from the elementary school. Students here are increasingly removed from everyday production agriculture. Absolutely, I was shocked last year when I had a student that I thought everybody knew it was just a joke that really thought that chocolate milk came from brown cows. And I thought, oh, this is unreal because we live in a farming community. But if Gonzalez and other teachers like her are successful, students in Oklahoma will have no question on the value of the farms all around them. Because I think it's going to be up to the United States to feed the world. And I think Oklahoma has a big part in that. Well, as Ag in the Classroom's Teacher of the Year, Gonzalez received a $500 honorarium from the Jackson family in memory of Paul Jackson, a great friend to agriculture and absolutely one of my favorite people to have ever spent some time with.